Look at this, the Bengals. Field Yates tweeting, have now officially unveiled their white alternate helmets for the season. Gentlemen, I think it's cold. Yeah, that's I fine. think it is <laughs> cold. Not as fine. You know, Nick, you played for the Ravens, RC. Obviously, you played for the Steelers. Sorry, your fins are out of this conversation. Best helmet AFC North, obviously. Honestly, honestly, never in my life would I, did I think I'd say this sentence. Yeah. That helmet would make me want to play <laughs> for the Bengals. Yeah. And that's something I, mean, I never wanted to do. Yeah. It's a, it's a great helmet. The Steelers helmets are nice, too, but, I mean, they're going to have to get a second sticker. Get another sticker for the other side. That's, I just it's about y'all. history. Oh, I know. I, I know it's about history, but now we're in the present. Double we're stickers. N- we're not get- some... Some new team that just <laughs> popped up in the 2000s. Sorry. Oh, Nick, you don't you don't crank Grandpa up again. That's, that's the, that is by far the best helmet in the NFL, though. Oh, the, the Cincinnati one? Yeah, absolutely. It's, it's, yes. it's phenomenal. I would take a one piece in that with that print. Okay, I'm with it. All right, let's keep going here, guys. So uh, the Bengals obviously were the surprise team in the NFL season ago. I didn't really think that was that funny, but that's cool. I love awkward moments. Um, you know, just another day in the office. Channing, which NFL team do you think will surprise us this year? The Dolphins. Not because I'm from Miami. Look at you. You just he, listen. You just talked about the Steelers. Oh, no, no, it's, 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 it's getting oh, it's one becoming a lot. He gets though. so excited. The Dolphins have a top ten defense. They had it last year. They're gonna, it's going to be top ten. They, they, Xavier Howard, what are they Byron gonna do? Jones, Javon what's, Holland. What's Miami going to do? Tell me that. How far are they Tua, going? If Tua can perform, RC had his list, yeah. and it's the pressure on Tua. Yeah. They have every weapon they want. They mm-hmm. went and solidified the O-line. Their defense is going to ball. If Tua is yeah. what we thought he was in Alabama, yeah. and like Tyreek Hill says, yeah. one of the most accurate quarterbacks, or Tyreek okay. says the most accurate quarterback in the league. Yeah. If Tua can... can, can a, Tyreek's lying. Can, okay. <laughs> I think it's genius. He did Tyreek, have sunglasses on when he said it to us. It's <laughs> genius because Tyreek's taking all the pressure off Tua. Yeah. It's genius. Okay. I think this is all calculated out of Tyreek. He has his weapons. Jalen Waddle, Tyreek, who yeah. are you going to double? Mike Gusecki yeah. running down the middle. Yeah. Tight end, they just franchised him. If Tua is what we think he is yeah. and what Tyreek is... Lying about him being, yeah. I guess, RC. I think the Dolphins can make can. It's going to be tough because the Bills, I think, is the best team in the NFL yeah. right now. But they can come out that AFC East and try to get one of them wild card positions. Okay. Saints. Why are you looking at me like that? Because it's. I feel like it's just like a lame answer. You're like whatever. Like you haven't put I, much thought into it. I put, a, really... I put a. I put a. I put a ton <laughs> of thought into it. You were James... passionate about I don't, it. I don't I think. I feel like you just went Saints. Like everyone's just picking their city. Well, first like, of all, I'm gonna go Giants. Oh wait, I didn't even think about that. Yeah. I didn't even think about that. Yeah. So first of all, nobody talked to me, so I didn't know I was next. Oh. Right. So the, the <laughs> well, answer. I looked at you. I, mean, I, I know, what but you didn't. What did you think was happening? I didn't. I was waiting for Sam or somebody to be like RC next. You know how they do that, Molly. And then it's my turn <laughs> to go. Sometimes the host whenever, does it. Carry I know, on. but you just looked at. I was moment. confused. I, I was confusion. <laughs> and so it's your moment. Okay, I'm back. I'm back now. So here's why I think the Saints. Much like Channing's talked about, the Saints have had a championship caliber defense the last three or four years. Yeah. The problem the Saints had was when Drew Brees got to the playoffs, he could no longer throw the football. They couldn't push the football down the field. Age was starting mm-hmm. to catch up with him. And one time they missed a call. And so now when you think about this defense, you lost both safeties, but you pick up Marcus May from the Jets. Now you have Tyron Matthew. Demario Davis, one of the Tyron more Matthew. underrated players in the entire NFL, especially at the linebacker position. Yeah. And you know you're going to be able to rush the quarterback up yeah. front. Now think about this. Michael Thomas, just a couple of years ago, and we've forgotten because yeah. he's been injured, he broke the record yep. for receptions in a season. Can't guard Chris, Olave, Chris, Chris Olave comes out maybe the most refined route runner in the entire in the entire draft, and he's also 4-3. Then you add Jarvis Landry to the mix, who is an experienced pass catcher at the slot position. And Jameis Winston was 5-2 and two last year and starting for the New Orleans Saints and just having an opportunity to know I don't have to get it all every single play. Now, we're still waiting to see what happens with Alvin Kamara, but we haven't even mentioned Taysom Hill and what he provides for this offense. This is a scary team. And we also have to remember that even within the NFC South, they own Tom Brady. The New Orleans yep. Saints, that yeah, is, that's true. own Tom Brady yeah. in the regular season. I think this team could be scary good if the offense comes together in a way that I believe they yeah. can. And Jameis plays at the top of his talent, which we've seen him do before. 
This could be a very shut up. Maybe this could he should have been. Maybe he should have been on that pressure list. <laughs> Did you hear what he said? James I was talking Winston. about you. I knew you was about to say something. Are you talking about Jameis? Yeah. yeah. RC. Oh. Jameis Winston. Yes. He did get the picks <laughs> under control. He only, he only, he only had he one year. Have you doing seen that? this workouts this offseason with a dude slapping him with pool noodles? Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube for live streaming sports and premium content. Subscribe to ESPN Plus.